Hello gorgeous! I am really happy because it's springtime and with spring comes all sorts of pastel colors and one of my favorite pastel colors is definitely peach. If you follow my blog then you know I've been talking a lot about peach recently and um, this look, although it's not necessarily specifically peach, it's definitely in the peach gold nude family which happens to be my very favorite color family and I really enjoy this look. If you follow me on Snapchat then earlier this evening, um, which if you're watching now will be a few days ago, I posted that I had made a beauty run and I had posted about the products that I had picked up and I was so excited to jump right into using them that I already filmed the video like three hours later. Maybe I'm addicted guys, I don't know. Um, if you guys want to see how I got this look, right here, keep on watching. Hi guys! Okay, so first up we're going to prime those lids. I'm just using my Lorac Eye Primer all over the lid. Then I'm going right into the palette, the Unzipped Gold Obsessed, using Undressed First, which is this amazing um, opaque nude shade. And check out that pigment. It is fantastic. Putting that lash line to brow bone just for a nude base. Next, I'm going in with Uninhibited. I'm just gonna pack that in right on the inner corner of my eye. There's gonna be some fallout because it's shimmer. Don't worry, we'll clean that up with a makeup wipe if we need to. Next, we're going in with Unpredictable and I'm just gonna pack that in right on the center of my lid. Okay, now we're going in with a little bit of Unlimited and we're just gonna put that right on the outside corner of our eye and blend that into the center. Using Unleashed and a flat shader brush, I'm using the 239 from MAC. I'm just gonna pack that in on the outside corner of my eye to darken up so that we can create a beautiful cat eye. Then I'm gonna take it right underneath my lower lash line and smoke it out a little bit. Now I'm going in with Unwind on a fluffy brush and I'm just gonna blend that into my crease so that there's a nice transition between all of the shimmer and then the highlighted brow bone. Using Unwind again, I'm just using a short liner brush and I'm creating a cut crease effect by taking it right into the crease of my eye. I'm going in with a little unpredictable and I'm just patting that all over my lid. This is just a really beautifully um, pigmented shimmery shade. Now I'm using Unlocked and I'm just gonna apply that to my brow bone. Guys, this shade is gorgeous for highlighting. You could use this for a highlighter all over your face. Then I'm gonna go back in with Unwind and I'm just applying that to the outside corner of my eye to darken it up a bit. Okay, I'm not doing it backwards. I am doing this strategically, just trust me. I'm doing lashes first, then I'm going in with my gel liner, and I'm gonna tight line and um, get more of a natural lash line. Then I'm going right to the brows using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Wiz Pencil and filling them in. So my skin isn't looking fantastic, so I need a little bit of heavy coverage. I'm going in with my Amazonian clay foundation and just applying that all over my face. I'm using my NARS Radiant Concealer in light and I'm just applying that to highlight under my eyes, forehead, bridge and nose, you know, all those normal highlighted spots. To set that highlight in place and to contour, I'm using my absolute very favorite palette, the Kat Von D uh, Shade and Light Palette. Um, if you guys haven't already seen my tutorial on this palette, I'll link it below for you because this, this is like the mecca of contouring for me right now. I'm using the new MAC Beauty Powder in Pearl Blossom, which is a gorgeous highlighting shade on my cheekbones. So I'm going right back into that palette and I'm pulling the lightest color and I am using that as a highlighter as well. Still using my damp beauty blender, I'm gonna use a little bit of this Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder right under my eyes. It just really brightens up that under eye area. To open my eyes up and just look really awake and alert, I'm waterlining with a bright white eyeliner. Now onto lips, I am using my NYX liner in Nude Beige, just overlining a tiny, tiny bit. Then going in with my new MAC 
lipstick and I'm first using Pure Vanity, applying a single coat and then I'm gonna top that off with another coat and I'm gonna use Caddy this time, which is also a new MAC lipstick. And to top all of that off and get a really gorgeous, you know, gloss, I'm just adding Turkish Delight from NARS. So here's the final look. I really like this for spring. It's really soft and pretty and neutral and I, I love this eyeshadow palette. I could not be happier with a purchase than the Lorac Unzipped palette. I love it. And guys, anything that I used in today's video will be listed in the description bar below as well as on my blog, AngelaLanter.com. So go check those out. And I post on my blog every day, so make sure that you're following me over there. And come say hello to me over on Instagram and Twitter and Snapchat, all those fun places. And if you have any requests for any looks or um, hair tutorials or anything like that that you'd like to see from me, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching, and I love you all so much. Au revoir. Intro to makeup look. Intro to makeup look.